Well, the countdown is on now for the Academy Awards. It's Monday and we've got a little less than a week to the big show. In just six days, winners will grace the stage to claim their Oscar. So we're gearing up for Oscar Sunday. A few movies filmed right here in Las Vegas took home the golden statue in their day. Now more productions are coming to town with incentives luring them here. Samantha Thomas is around town live in front of the iconic Bellagio fountains, which we have seen in a few movies, but most notably Ocean's Eleven. Well, well, Beth and Dana, just a few minutes ago, the fountain was on by popular media request, but they've gone off right now, but that's okay. Just think back to 18 years ago when the dashing Danny Ocean and his witty crew of criminals stood right here filming that iconic scene. Fast forward to now with some new incentive to keep films rolling in the Vegas and in the state. See there's a fountain is on. The power of our brand is important. Um, but above that we need to have qualified crew and the locations and the infrastructure and the, the, the business environment that promotes these filmmakers to want to come here. And, and Nevada is a place to do business. Nevada Film Office Director Eric Priest is in the business of show business, and he's committed to keeping films and jobs coming into the valley and the state. Yeah, you know, it's a business like any other. So people are looking for the right environment to do business, and Nevada creates a good environment for them to do business, so they want to come here. Priest says close to 40 states now offer filming incentives. So while it is very competitive and there's a lot of filmmaking that happens in California and New York and Georgia, uh, Nevada and Las Vegas are always at the top of the list because of the power of the assets and the power of our brand. And in this business, we know that location is key when it comes to the overall production. Vegas is a very popular brand and we know that from films like The Hangover and Ocean's Eleven and all these great films that come here, they come here because of the power of our brand. Well, from the time it started to now, we've definitely obviously seen an increase because we, we didn't have it before. Uh, and productions, again, it's a business, it's show business. The tax credit is transferable and expires four years after issue. It offers 15% back of the production costs, including 15% on wages, salaries, and fringe benefits for all Nevada residents hired on a production. Now, if you want to pan on in, you see the water is dancing this morning. Thank you so much, Bellagio. That's what it looked like 18 years ago. I can't believe it was 18 years ago. But the film tax credit is just five years old. And the Nevada Film Office says it issues like hundreds of credits for films every year. Ocean's Eleven now, while it didn't win any Academy Awards, I want to backtrack because earlier I said Casino won an Academy Award, which it didn't. It was Leaving Las Vegas and Rain Man that won the Academy Awards for being filmed here in Las Vegas and for just great cinematography as a whole. Channel 13, Samantha Thomas, Channel 13, oh, yeah. Elevating Las Vegas. Love oh, Rain Man. I think Rain Man. Sharon Stone, though, from Casino was yes. nominated for an award for Best Actress. I don't know if she won it. Yeah. I don't think so. But there's a little casino tie in there. Well done, Samantha. Thank you. We'll look forward to seeing all of your reports Thank on the you. Oscars all week long. All right.